Hey everyone, it's Overjudge, and welcome back to Let's Play Kirby Triple Deluxe. Uh, so the last thing we're going to do, uh, it's going to take a few parts, it's going to take the rest of this week actually, but the uh, last thing we're going to do is collect all of the, the remaining sunstones. You can see there in the corner it says 69 out of 100. Uh, here's all the numbers for all of the uh, levels. Uh, I'm afraid on the bottom the screen you can't see them that well, but oh well. And uh, here we are in level 1, stage 3. Now, uh, you'll notice I've got the hammer power up, uh, see it a little bit if I'm running around. Uh, basically, uh, if you go to the the, the practice, copyability practice test room, whatever it's called. Um, you can grow a power-up, take it out, and you keep that power-up. So, for most of this, I'm going to be using the hammer power-up. Um, obviously, there is uh, one or two, certainly this one, uh, that will require hypernova, so no hammer power-up there. But anyway, uh, let's get going. Rather than take you through the whole level, which would be a bit silly, I'm just going to skip ahead to the part where uh, I actually get the sunstone in question and then uh, exit the level. So I will see you there. Okay, so here we are. Uh, hold on, actually, I better go back out through this door and show you. Um, it's obviously in the bit where you have hypernova. Uh, there's a, a guy here you have to suck up, and there's a block here. Uh, you put it along and it smashes. Uh, you can go back to pot one or two of the LP for that. Anyway, uh, go up this ladder and remember, uh, hold on, pull these down first. I remember that I was having trouble with these uh, wrecking balls. Yeah, I wasn't pulling them back far enough. Uh, I did discover that late into the LP. Uh, you pull it back until it shines and then it completely smashes it rather than knocking it down. That really is all I needed to do in this level. So, uh, grab that treasure chest. There is my third sunstone of this level. All one three sunstones collected. Huzzah. So, uh, after that, I guess I will see you at the end of the level. Okay then, so uh, at the end of the level, here we are. The uh, reason I'm showing this is... Uh, oh, you see in just a second, hold on. Uh, launch myself out of the cannon. Oh, number two. I thought I might have got number one there. Oh, well. Get my stars, get my food that I don't need... Oh yeah, I managed to get this level's rare keychain. Uh, there is in fact one per level, and uh, I think I said it during DDD tour. But uh, if you if you get that, then the next time you get the level, there won't be a rare keychain. But as such, I got the triple star keychain here. And if you ever get the rare keychain in World One Three, then you know that is the keychain you will get. They're rare in that they're basically one of a kind and in specific places. So uh, that's that one for this level. That's the only reason I really showed you the end of that. Uh, that was in the background in one place where you had to cut down or burn down some grass. Uh, you know, if you're actually actively burning down grass, then you'll probably find that place. Anyway, now that we've finished the level, that was the only sunstone left in uh, World 1, Level 1. So you get an extra stage for collecting every sunstone in the level. But finding 12 sunstones, you've unlocked an extra stage. Yeah, thank you, that's what I just said. So, uh, get this extra stage. Uh, this particular one has only one sunstone in it, so hopefully I can find that for you. Uh, I'm obviously not going to be skipping over this one, because it's uh, brand new stuff I haven't shown you before. Um, you'll notice now the count says 12 out of 13 in the corner. I just pointed that to, to that with my thumb, as if you could see my thumb. <laughs> but, uh, yeah, so... In the Sunstones menu, you now get the extra level. You don't get the extra levels on any of the others. So that is why if... Uh, hold on, on the pause menu, you've got uh, all these numbers here. If you notice the totals, the you know, on, for example, uh, level 4 is probably going to be easiest for you to say. It's 15 out of 17 and so on. If you add up the, the total amount that you can get, it doesn't quite add up to the 100. And that's because of these extra stages, which the game doesn't tell you about until you get to them. So uh, I didn't know about them until I went to complete it 100% on my other file. Okay, so here we go. Uh, the extra level. Uh, this is my second take. Uh, I'm not sure if I'm going to show the first take. Probably not. <laughs> uh, I missed. I don't know if it was sunstone, but it was certainly something I wanted to get. So uh, I was saying in the first take, I didn't uh, practice these when I was doing my uh, runs to check where all the sunstones were. And uh, it shows, because I screwed up. Uh, hopefully that won't happen too often. I can't make any promises, though. Uh, so, moseying along. Get rid of you. I think that's what I said the first time. Don't want to get a tree falling on me. Like that. That's what I didn't want. I was greedy there and started to kill things myself. Oh well, I'm sure I'll find some food eventually. Uh, that tree fall down. Okay, so this is where I thought the uh, sunstone was, and it wasn't. So chop down a tree with my hammer. That is a thing that it is possible to do. 
come through here. And this just actually has the rare keychain in it, not the uh, sunstone. And then, like an idiot, I rushed into the door. How did I lose my power? Where's it going? Oh, phew, it went that way. Give it back, give it back. Phew. Yeah, in here is what I missed. Uh, some stars. I did a whole retake because I've missed some stars. Oh well. Let's go. Uh, oh, springing up on me like that. That's naughty. Any more? Uh, no, but cousins are going to throw their things at me, so I should go back there. Okay, what's up here? Nothing much. Are these guys going to... Yep. Oh, they dropped back. They're little cowards. Hey! I'll show you. Anyway, there's a breakable one up there, so let's get that. I was going to say, hopefully it has some food. It has some stars. Oh, well. I'll get food at the end of the level. I still don't like these big guys, even with the hammer that I can use to kill them fairly easily. Especially not when they swarm me like this. Oh well. Uh, yeah, I've had a lot of practice with the hammer, because I was using it a lot in uh, True Arena when I was trying to practice to get to uh, Soul of Sectonia. Who is the secret boss there? Uh, I put it in the actual text, the description of that previous part, but... Uh, I know some people don't read the text, so I'm saying it now. Uh, Sol of Sectonia, who is the secret boss of the True Arena. I got to Sol of Sectonia and got my uh, backside handed to me in practice, so uh, I decided it's really just not worth it, especially when 100% involves going through and getting all the keychains anyway. And hey, I swung at that bear. Oh well. Uh, yes, it was worth it for that star. Oh, some food, good. Hey, you don't want to get... Don't get crushed. Well, unless the keychain is in a blindingly obvious spot right at the end of the level, like, say, down a hole. Uh, now, how am I going to do this? Uh, apparently by dodging around it. And that was a keychain! Unless the, gem the, the sunstone is in a blindingly obvious spot at the end of the level, as I was saying. Uh, I'm going to miss it, apparently. Oh. Okay, still not here. I'm getting a little worried that I've missed it now. Uh, oh, is that a miniboss coming up? I'll we'll find out in just a second, because, uh, yep, it's a miniboss coming up. I'll uh, we'll take your pudding, thank you very much, uh, Bandana Waddle <laughs> Launching across. Which miniboss have we got this time? It's Blocky DX. A uh, Blocky DX I managed to pretty much master. Wait. Oh, I wasn't supposed to do that. Oh, I wasn't supposed to do that either. There we go. So, uh, apparently you get deluxe boxes in uh, extra stages as well, rather than regular mini bosses. Well, this treasure just doesn't have a sunstone in it. It does, okay. And there we go. That's the sunstone for this level. It was blindingly obvious in the end. And end of the level. Huzzah! Oh, that was nowhere near enough. That was probably a number three, or maybe even number four. Number three. Oh, only end of number three. Okay. That was a bit further than I thought it was, apparently. Uh, I've heard if you manage to get uh, in consecutive levels... Uh, number seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. You get something ridiculous like thirty extra lives. Uh, no idea if it's true. It would take a whole lot of skill to do that, and it simply isn't worth it because you are not going to use the lives you get in this. Anyway, keychains, hammer, Kirby. Yep, the rare one was power paintbrush. Okay then. And yeah, just go through the rest of these. All one of the rest. And so there we go. Now we definitely have every sunstone in uh, fine fields. So we're off to uh, world two or level two, I guess, which is lollipop land. Actually, before that, I'll very quickly uh, show you. This is something that uh, people in the comments have been saying. If you take the first letter, uh, it's alliterative, but if you take the first letter of each stage, so fine fields F, lollipop land L, and so on, uh, you can see all this. Uh, you can't see all the stage names there. I thought you could. Uh, you can see all the stage names here <laughs> under the Sunstones menu. So, Fine Fields, Lollipop Land, Old Odyssey, Wild World, Enders Explosions, and Royal Road. It, it makes the word flower, which is a nice little Easter egg that uh, I didn't notice uh, until the comments. So, thank you guys in the comments. Anyway, uh, World 2 Stage 3, we have one to get here. So, once again, I will uh, meet you at the Sunstone. 
or thereabouts. Okay, so here we are. Uh, there's a bomb here. I will skip the bomb quickly and uh, remind you what happened. There's our sunstone. Uh, these little blocks here, these stairs, uh, first time around in this stage, I destroyed them before picking up the bomb because I was an idiot. And I needed them to carry the bomb up here and throw the bomb there and then get the sunstone. So, uh, that one, actually fairly simple. I was just an idiot at the time. Um, I only have myself to blame. So, uh, take this back, and I will finish the stage and see you guys there. Okay, and we're back. Uh, once again, I'm showing you the cannon because I managed to get the, uh, rare keychain in this stage. Uh, it is just above the exit door. I might actually just tack it on uh, just before this. Just above the exit door, uh, you can actually just float up above the exit door and uh, there's a little secret area out there. Oh, that's a, that's bad. That's a seven. Oh well. I was hoping for a little bit of healing there because I lost a little bit of life to uh, Gigantage. How I happened, I don't know, but I did. So, uh, keychains. Yeah, got Swimming Kirby. That was new. That's good to know. Okay. And the secret was Love Love Stick, apparently. From Dreamland 3. There you go. That's what I really wanted to show you here. And there's the sunstone. So, uh, on to stage 4. We need the first stone here. Uh, oh, yeah, okay, I'm looking at my notes. This one's actually pretty simple. So, uh, I will see you there again. Okay, and we're back. Uh, you see that guy down there with the key? Yeah, we need to uh, get to the end of this area before he does. So, uh, that's, again, something I guess I just didn't manage to do the first time around. This time around, I have hammer. So, let's go. Ah! Oop. Don't let that thing hit us. And here he comes. Uh, I believe he'll jump onto this. Uh, uh, no, no, no. He won't jump anywhere. I need to get to this. There we go. <laughs> and I got it. And there is our sunstone. All two four sunstone collected. Huzzah. And that's that one. So, once again, I will just see you at the end of the level. So there we go, yep, we've unlocked the extra stage here as well, uh, and of course we're going to quickly go and do that uh, right now. So uh, stage 6, extra stage. Uh, once again, I didn't practice this, so I might just mess up. Oh yes, this is this one, where you get lots of uh, things dropping down on you. Oh no, it's not! Okay. I thought it was. Uh, oh, you do get things dropping down on you, okay. There goes another one. And another one, quickly get over here, that wasn't too bad. Oh, that's right, I remember this one because the uh, brown blocks that you can't jump over. Uh, you can't jump over, you can jump over them, you can't smash them, even with the hammer. Uh, if the game gives you a wheel, it's a good idea to use it, so... Plow through all this. Oh, get those, jump up here, go across there. Wheel is a nice power up in the sections that it's designed for. Outside of those, uh, it's really not that great. And uh, I probably want to go down there. So let's go down there. And there's a keychain. Okay, I thought it would be uh, something a little, more, uh, a little bit more important. But there you go. Uh, well, that's a uh, fake. <laughs> I was going to say that's obvious enough, but uh, yep, it fooled me. Don't know how. It shouldn't have, but there you go. Okay, up here. Uh, anything? Yes, there was that above there. <laughs> Nothing huge, but uh, okay. Get the time on this. Get in there for those. And use the door. There you go. The right door this time. Actually, we're out of the wheel segment, so I'm going to drop wheel and grab fighter. It's not nearly as good as hammer, but it's... Uh, it's pretty good. Is that going to drop? It is going to drop. Okay. I don't want to get smashed by it. Uh, 
There is nothing to see there. Okay. Let's make sure that nothing is uh, going to. Ah, uh, phew! I was going to say nothing is there to pick up, like a key, for example. Uh, oh, this key is only going to get me to that uh, rare key chain anyway. I think. Yeah. So we'll get to see what that is at the end of the level. Yeah, I'd say uh, Hammer is probably the best power-up. I'd say Fighter is a close second, just in terms of raw power. Anything up there? No. Okay. Boy. Uh, I think I remember this one. Uh, do that. Do that. Go down. Not 100% sure what's triggering the uh, things for the cannon to fall down, but... I remember doing this first time around and uh, getting every single uh, block here with the cannon and I'm going to continue to do that, which isn't too hard because there's only that to go. Hey, there we go. And a tiny little block that it can destroy there. Don't think I didn't notice you. Oh, go down. And off it goes, so dropping into the abyss. Or just crushing. Okay, this is another one where you have to beat... Uh, no, you don't have to beat the guy. The guy will open the door for you this time. You just have to... Uh, I would advise blowing up the one on the right first. Because uh, otherwise you're going to be under a bit of time pressure. If he bonks into that one on the right on his way down, he'll turn around and drop off the cliff. Which obviously you don't want. So, uh, yep. He opened the door for us. Thank you very much, little key guy. I'll grab my keychain. I'll grab my one-up. Is that all that was here? I thought there would be a thing here. Uh, sunstone. Oh uh, well, uh, apparently I must continue in the level to get the sunstone. Hello, Waddle You got an ice cream for pudding. Thank you very much, uh, thing. Uh, fighter or I already have fighter and I'm keeping it. That looks intimidating, but you can't actually get crushed by those because obviously you just can't get there in time. Flame Galbraith DX, uh, I found a very good method for, which is sit right next to him and pummel away. Because he'll launch things over your head. Uh, with the hammer, he'd be dead by now. Oh! I, uh, yeah. With the hammer, he doesn't usually get that far. Let's see, so, uh. Ah! Yeah, I'm very n not used to using anything but hammer, but yeah, I could also do this sort of infinite dive kick on him. That works too. Uh, I was going to say, I remember seeing something up there, but no. Okay, so uh, I was going to say again, unless it's a really obvious end of level one, which it is. There it is. I keep acting sceptical, but that's because uh, these early stages have one, and it's obviously at the end of the level. Later stages will have more... Late, later extra stages will have more than one. And so, uh, I'm just going to get this over with. I don't need the stuff that the goal game gives me anyway. I don't need stars. I don't really need health. Three stars. Wow. Uh, I got Gorgor. Okay, the rare one. Here we go. Uh, one-up Meta Knight keychain. Ooh. And there we go, yeah, just skip, skip past all that. There we go, okay. I'm going to go get uh, Hammer Power Up, and I will meet you in World 3 for uh, the next level that we need to do. Okay, so here we are at uh, World 3, Level 3, Old Odyssey, and uh, the first Sunstone Stage 1 is what I need. This is one of those ones that's uh, hidden in an unusual way. I doubt anyone would get this their first time through, so I'll... Skip to where it is. Okay then, so here we are. Uh, we've just gone through a room with some cannons in, if that's any help. Uh, there's an arrow pointing up, so the most obvious thing to do is go up, right? No. We want to go down, fall off the edge of the earth as if we're going to die, and it turns out we can get a star that takes us to the back. Yeah. That's what they expect you to do in this game. Go and nearly die to find the secrets. 
I mean, I don't so much mind. I, I, you don't need every sunstone. Ow! I didn't know that stepping on the cannon could hurt you. Anyway, uh, let's just get this done. Uh, yep, there we go. That door is where we need to go. Uh, hop in this cannon. And launch it down there. You see the sunstone's on the right. Uh, not the left. You don't want to hit a Gordo, trust me. Uh, what happens if you just... If you launch yourself out and not into one of those, it's just sort of... Can you... No, you can't get out of it. Uh, what happens if I do go here? Yeah, okay, you hit a Gordo, and uh, there's a door here, and there's something you can do. Uh, it's going to give us another chance. Uh, I just never did that. I thought there might have been some food or something around there. No, there's nothing. Just death. Well, not death. <laughs> just harm. Okay, so let's try this again. There's the sunstone on the right, so we're going to go to the right this time. Uh, oh, I missed the food that was in the middle. That's probably where I was seeing food. Anyway, uh, that's the sunstone for this level, so once again, I'll see you at the end. Well, actually, no, I'll, I'll show you the rest of this at the background, because we haven't... Oh, there you go, there's the rest of this at the background. Okay, I'll see you at the end. Okay then, so uh, the only thing left for us here is uh, this stage, stage 2. There's uh, two sunstones we need here, so uh, let's get right on with it. Uh, show you going into the stage there, but otherwise I'll just uh, show you where the sunstones are, as usual. So, back in a second. Okay, so in this room, uh, it's just after the way you get the first sunstone. Uh, it's quite an easily identifiable room. There's lots of sand blocks here that will get destroyed when you stand on them. Like so. Uh, on the right here, there's a giant stone head that I didn't want to think about. If you do go ahead and destroy it, and that's probably going to be the easiest way, there's a door here. And inside that door is going to be our uh, sunstone behind the locked door here. Uh, it's a little bit of a challenge. And get rid of him without doing too many of those. That was not too hard. Uh, this part is the fun part. Oh, I want to actually jump rather than... There we go. Hey! Uh, hey! Oh, okay then, I survived, that's all that matters. <laughs> I still have the key, that's all that matters really. Uh, and there's our sunstone. And also some health for us. The understood we'll probably get hit. And so I will see you at stone 3. Okay, so it's in this room, with all these pillars and the destroying the bottoms of them. You might remember this one. Uh, I remember quite clearly missing this one, actually. Uh, just go get him. It doesn't matter whether or not these... I don't know what they're called, castle head guys. Oh! Don't you hit me while I'm looking. Uh, castle head guys, it doesn't matter if they're destroyed or not. Uh, go get that. I'm watching out for you this time, little flying guy. Anyway, uh, this one. I rather... Um, idiotically, I don't know, uh, rather stupidly destroyed it. When there was no need, there's a chest there, and we'll be going to get that chest as soon as we grab onto this star. So yeah, if you just if you let that pillar fall down, the chest falls down, you can't get the sunstone. There's the sunstone for us. And so once again I will see you at the end of the level. Which is right here, so <laughs> no no cut there. And uh, that's actually it for this part. I will uh, show you the goal game for no particularly good reason. So, uh, next time, we're going to go get uh, some more sunstones. We're going to finish off World 3, and then also do World 4 is what I have planned for the next part. So, until then, thanks for watching, everyone, and bye bye Ooh, I got Dreamland Bandit for getting 100 keychains. On my other file, I actually have uh, at least 150. You get another rank at that point, but uh, there you go. I got 100 keychains.